honeys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I have some new hair for you guys and it's from a company called s-noahlight.com. Um, they contacted me and asked me to review some hair so I said yeah. Um, this is not a paid review, they just sent me the hair to look at and give my honest opinion. Um, I went to their site and it seems like they have um, synthetic hair, clip-ins, virgin hair, wigs, you know, everything that you get from a, a hair website. It says 100% virgin hair, front lace wig, straight, length 18 inches, color 1B. Um, I'm guessing that this is a straight Brazilian virgin lace front wig because it's the only straight hair that they had on the site. Um, it didn't say on the bag or in the packaging, so I'm guessing that that's what it is. So this is what it looks like. It's really, really silky. Not like my hair texture at all. This is like really silky hair. <laughs> it doesn't have a smell, which is good because I did not feel like washing it just to review it. I'm gonna wash it later. But, um, and you should wash your hair when you get it, but it doesn't smell like factory or anything. <sighs> just doesn't smell like anything. So it has lace, all the way around the edges. And then it has a little bit of parting space right here, the lace front. And then the back of it is just the cap with the three combs, two on the side and one in the middle. And in the back you do have a adjustable cap. It does have a little bit of baby hairs right here and I don't know how to do baby hairs so we're gonna see how that will work. And the knots aren't bleached. I have not bleached any knots on a wig before and I need to learn so maybe that'll be my next video I'll use this as my test subject. So first what I'm gonna do is I just pulled my hair back and put it into four braids because I'm really not good at French braiding so if you know how to braid at all or do anything to pull your hair back just make sure the front part of it is slick and then put your hair into something that's manageable. Ah, I do not look good like this. Okay, so I'm gonna start cutting the lace. I'm gonna make sure that I um, look out for the baby hairs in the front. Um, you don't wanna cut those off and make sure that you don't cut too far into the hairline because that'll ruin it. So just start cutting. You can always go back and cut more. So if you wanna just cut it like an inch or so away from the hairline, just in case you're scared, and then go back and clean it up, that's fine too. Okay, so I went and I flat ironed the hair a little bit and I um, didn't pluck the part much. I just tried to put a little bit of powder on my part and that's about it. I don't, I didn't glue the hair down. I didn't, um, I have none of my hair out, which is great. This is gonna be a great protective style. But I, I really, I really actually like this hair. It's a bit shiny and I don't know why, but um, other than that, I have no issues with this. I feel like I can put this hair on and go. It is 18 inches. I feel like it's longer than 18 inches because it's literally going past my boob. I wish I had um, a tape measure so I could measure it, but it's long, it's natural looking to me. It's not like over the top too much where I don't think I would be able to wear it in an executive setting or anything, but it also looks like sleek, like I could wear it out somewhere and be cute and go out. So um, yeah, I haven't put anything in it. It just looks like this. I love how silky this hair is. It feels like when I used to get a perm and it would just like glide through your fingers. It doesn't have a whole lot of body and you know volume or anything, but I do think that it will hold a curl and I do think it looks very natural. I didn't leave any of my edges out. Literally all my hair is pulled back like you saw before. So this is a great protective style. Um, I just took a little bit of gel and I kind of, I don't have baby hair, so I don't know why, but I kind of, whatever hair I had left out, tried to like slick it down and then I, this has the baby hairs and I tried to put that down with it. I need to practice a little bit more on that. And on this side, I just didn't do anything. So it is a little round right here, but I think once I pluck the perimeter a little bit more and learn how to lay the baby hairs down on the wig, it'll look much more um, realistic. And then had a couple flyaways up at the top. I just took a little bit of gel or you can take um, hairspray, spray it and I just went like that to get the flyaways. But um, other than that, I think that this hair looks very natural. It almost looks like when I used to get a perm. It's good hair to me. I don't have a problem with it. There's essentially no shedding. Um, I did get the whole 18 inches and I can wear it to work. That's everything that I asked for in a wig. So I'll do a review in a couple weeks once I get some natural wear and tear on it and I'll come back and show you how it looks. I'll also leave a link in the description for where you can purchase this hair. And until next time, have a good one.